definitely have to be physically fit. We're athletes. You have to be fit to do this job. If you don't work out, if you don't hike, you're not going to be able to be, you're not going to be good at your job and you're not going to be able to be on the crew. For this job, you need cardio. Oh, you break a sweat. <laughs> you have to run two miles in 18 minutes, pull-ups, push-ups, crunches. We're hiking in the mountains. You don't know where it's going to stop. I think the hardest part for me was the hiking, definitely. We're going to a place where bulldozers and all this heavy equipment can't go. We're the ones that have to fight that out in the middle of nowhere. And it's a lot different than hiking like without a pack and without Nomex. So even when you're not on the clock, you still got to be committed. They gave us advice, told us the three common groups we should do a week, which is legs, back and abs, and then chest. For me, it's a lot of like core and legs. The rest, I feel like I got it, but I still got to work on it, of course. I'm 145, which is also like, I'm already kind of thin, but I put on 20 pounds of muscle, which is weird. I've never been this like big in my life. Just working out, hiking, eating right, and uh, like I said, I stopped being a vegan, so it kind of helped. <laughs> I like to run, I like to lift weights a lot. I try to like stay in shape, like with my own workout plan. <clears throat> you know, we do hikes, we do Sierra Alto. Total of four miles today. 1,500 feet, gaining elevation. With these packs here, I think I have like around maybe 50 pounds right now. When I first joined this crew, that was my very first hike, and I threw up on it, so. And we're halfway through and I'm just like, you know, you want to drop out. You're like, my legs are burning, I'm cramping, can't breathe. And just mentally, you just got to push yourself through that. How I was a year ago to where I'm at now, I'm not the best and I'm not the worst, but I am a lot better than what I was. I'm in shape now. My legs don't hurt that much anymore. It's really nice to see where your mind can actually take you because it's mostly mindset. <laughs> Being mentally fit, just so you can push yourself past those limits, is I think more important, honestly. See it as an opportunity to better myself. I wasn't as fit as I was before, and now it's like, it's a sense of pride. And if you want it, go get it. Don't let anyone tell you you can't do it.